All right, we got the P, which means we can auto park. So I'm gonna put the car in reverse. That gives me the screen to go ahead and start the auto park, which I'm gonna do. And now the car takes over and backs into the space. Now I've yet to see it back in straight in without almost hitting the car behind it. There's a Kia right there. But I trust it, I trust the sensors. It will pull forward now and begin to straighten out and park properly. There's a car also in front. It starts those sensors as well. And it says, no, 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 I can't go any further. And it starts to back up and even straighten up so it's perfectly between the white lines. Now, while it appears to be using the white lines for the backup process, you still need a car on each side in order for it to auto park into a parking space. Uh, it can parallel park as well. Once the auto park is complete, push the car in park, and all you have to do is get out. So that's a demo of the Tesla Model S and Model X or Model 3 for that matter, auto park into a parking space, into a regular parking lot. Cheers, everybody. Take care. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.